Hello and welcome to a new episode of Beyond the Boundary powered by Alista where we are joined by the UAE skipper Tirtha Satish whom we talked to ahead of the under 19 World Cup. Smart ho raha hai India. Jaise India mein bana Alista Smart LED TV with world class clarity and amazing features. What was your first reaction? when you heard that you will be leading the under 19 team uh i was pretty surprised because first the initial eligibility date was supposed to be 2004 september so initially i didn't qualify but i was super happy when i got to hear that i could just be part of the under 19 squad forget about captaincy just being a part of this team is an incredible opportunity and who was the first person you called after getting the news uh my parents uh both of them were at work when this news came out so i called them first okay and how was their reaction they were also super happy because all of us i think we j- we want really wanted to be part of the under 19 squad it's a super exciting opportunity and playing the world cup it's it's been a dream for everyone and just getting the opportunity to play they were super happy and obviously that was the first step towards what we were going to achieve what we supposed to see uh you know i heard that the movie kana inspired you to take cricket and the main lead also retweeted the article regarding your story how was that moment it was pretty overwhelming not going to lie um i wasn't expecting anything and so much response and reactions coming out of nowhere it was pretty overwhelming but yeah i'm very grateful for all the support that's been shown and obviously the movie in itself was incredible and just i can just thank be thankful and grateful for that i think there's nothing else and the main protagonist went on to win the world cup <laughs> how would it be to im- uh, like duplicate her story oh uh, winning the world cup is everyone's dream i mean every cricketer if not only cricket or any sport i mean world cup is the biggest thing that's there to win and if we get to win there's nothing like it i mean there's something we are aiming to do if it happens we got the best feeling uh tita do you remember the first day of your training when you started mm-hmm. cricket how was it like yeah i remember i was i like yeah. my first year i remember a bunch of girls walk in wearing the UAE jersey and i was shocked yeah, like to see the players come in front of me and i remember a few of them even vaishnavi was yeah. there the captain mahika uh, kushi there were so many people who are in the current squad right now so when i went there i just bowling to them i felt wow i'm bowling to a UAE player and even after the session got over i still remember kavisha doing extra throw downs with her father and i think that inspired me so much also and another girl sia she yeah. took up the in the yeah. so we were it was both of our first yeah. just being part of that session was incredible so i i still remember that day clearly uh, do you feel you are missing out on teenage stuff like other kids Mm, since I've been playing sports for a long time I guess sports has been my entire life so when I don't play sport I feel like I'm missing out on something I feel very incomplete without sports but no I guess it's a way of life now and I can't imagine it any other way yeah. and plus you get so much new experience you get to meet so many new people and learn so much from them which you wouldn't have been able to do it normally Yeah I was asking uh, your jersey number is 16 is it the same for the under 19 world cup Yeah Like how did you choose that number what's the story behind it Oh uh, 606 I wanted something unique meaning uh in football my jersey number was 10 and basketball it was 7 so I didn't want the same numbers coming again so I chose 16 because of it's my birthday birthday okay. date Okay so, I realize if you add six plus one, you get seven. So that's like Donny's number. And if you subtract six minus one, it's Jamima's number. So oh, okay. That's what. I, but initially, it was just like it's my birthday, so it's pretty special. You are part of the inaugural edition of the Under 19 World Cup, which is internal history. 
like how excited are you for the tournament i don't think there is any words there are any words to describe how excited we are I mean we've gone through the qualification process and so much hard work just for this one moment and to see it in front of our eyes i mean it's incredible and yeah it's just an exciting journey that we really don't know what to expect so we'll we're really looking forward to that how has been the guidance of seniors in preparation to this world cup yeah the seniors coaches and stuff all of them have helped us so much uh, they've come for our practice sessions regularly and they are constantly talking to us as well and uh, like you said they're guiding us to do and giving their experience and passing it down on to us and many of these girls have played in the senior team as well so they themselves are guiding the newcomers and the uh, newcomers into the squad on how to go about it and yeah there's support from everywhere the, like i said the parents staff coaching everyone it's been great yeah so captain to captain did <laughs> chaya gave you any advice yeah definitely if i have any doubt i do always ask her i mean she's really open to giving her advice and guidance so i'm really grateful for that as you said like you have eight uae players who have played in the senior team does it give you an edge in the tournament definitely it does give us an edge i mean playing in that international standard they played some big tournaments like the global qualifiers and asia cup as well which many people don't get that opportunity and i hope they can use that experience really well in the games upcoming games but yeah obviously it does give us a bit of an edge but yeah we'll see how it goes and uh, you have india and south africa in the in your group the two powerhouse teams how are you looking forward to that challenge it's super exciting you get to play a few of the strongest teams in the world and just playing against test playing nations it's something you're looking forward to and hopefully we can create some upsets but we'll see and yeah, like we yeah before. yeah it's going to be incredible to just face them and learn so much from them as well okay, who is the player to watch out for from the ua team oh, i wish i could tell you uh, <laughs> you can take yeah, your name <laughs> No, no. You, you have, you. There are many people, I think. Um, but the must watch, obviously, they are very talented. I don't. I think I, I don't. I don't know. It's tough to choose. There's too many names to say. I can't specify anyone. All right. Yeah. Fair. Women's IPL is coming up. Uh, yeah. So how would it be to return to India in women's IPL through women's IPL? Mm, it would be a big opportunity I mean that that would probably be one of the biggest tournaments or events that would happen next year and it'll be super exciting to share a dressing room with so many players and obviously playing in your home country will also be different experience and you everyone knows the fan base of cricket in India it's huge so it would be really exciting and a very new experience and you are a supporter of Chennai Super Kings would you like to play for them I would love to play for them, but <laughs> given a chance, I'd play for any team too. Okay, that makes sense also. Smart or India? Like India, made by Alistair Smart LED TV with world-class clarity and amazing features.